Androgen insensitivity syndrome ICE, is a rare genetic disorder that affects the development of sexual characteristics in individuals. It is also known as testicular feminization syndrome. ICE is caused by a mutation in the androgen receptor AR, gene, which is responsible for the body's response to male sex hormones called androgens. ICE affects people with XY chromosomes, who are genetically male, but their body does not respond to the androgens produced by their testes. As a result, individuals with ICE have female external genitalia and secondary sexual characteristics, such as breast development, but they do not have a uterus or ovaries. Wait a minute! Who are you? Why are you gay? Who says I'm gay? You are gay. Their internal reproductive structures, such as the testes, are typically undescended and may be located in the abdomen or groin area. The severity of ice can vary widely, and there are three subtypes of the condition. Complete ice, partial ice, and mild ice. In complete ice, individuals have female external genitalia and are typically raised as girls. They may not realize they have ice until puberty, when they do not menstruate and do not develop pubic hair or underarm hair. Partial and mild ice may result in varying degrees of masculinization, with individuals having a mix of male and female physical characteristics. Ice is typically diagnosed in infancy or childhood when doctors discover the absence of a uterus during a routine examination. Genetic testing can confirm the diagnosis. Treatment for ICE typically involves surgery to remove the testes, which are at risk of developing cancer, and hormone replacement therapy to induce puberty and develop secondary sexual characteristics. In some cases, individuals may choose to undergo cosmetic surgery to modify their external genitalia to more closely align with their gender identity. It is what it is. It is what it is. Living with ICE can be challenging for individuals and their families, as the condition can be difficult to understand and may involve complex medical treatments. However, with appropriate medical care and support, individuals with ICE can lead happy and fulfilling lives. It is important to raise awareness about ICE to promote understanding and acceptance of individuals with the condition. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe my channel.